Hello, uh, we will be now studying an important topic called capacitation from general anatomy which usually comes as a brief question or short question under these headings. First one definition what it is, what is capacitation? You can write it like this, it is a final step of maturation or conditioning of the spermatozoa, it is a final step of maturation or conditioning of the spermatozoa. Site, where that conditioning or maturation happens? It happens in the female genital tract. After the ejaculation of the sperms within the female genital tract, it happens. Time, how much time it takes for the sperm to undergo capacitation? It roughly takes around 7 hours of time. Process, what is the process of capacitation? So, it is a process where the glycoprotein coat and the seminal proteins are removed from the plasma membrane that lies within the over the head that is the acrosomal region of the spermatozoa. The glycoprotein coat and the seminal proteins are removed from the plasma membrane that overlies the head that is within the acrosomal region of the sperm. Fate, what is the fate? Fate that means only this sperms which undergo capacitation can penetrate the corona radiata cells and can undergo acrosome reaction and then only they can dissolve the zona pellucida surrounding the ovum. Clinical correlation like I mean in in vitro fertilization or in layman language the tissue babies, the capacitation of the sperms is done by treating the ejaculate, the sperm ejaculate and placing it in a solution containing uh, free serum containing free serum, dextran, follicular fluid, adrenal gland extract, gamma globulin, and even the serum diacylate. So, the ejaculated sperms in in vitro fertilization is treated with a solution containing all these things and that favors the process of capacitation. This is all about a small topic called capacitation. Thank you.